We've all seen it. You post a job and get a stack of applicants for positions, and then begins the work of determining who's qualified. There are some college diplomas in the stack, but what do those pieces of paper mean? That they endured a certain number of classes, that they had been through a certain stack of books, that they paid a substantial amount of money, likely borrowed, for the chance to get it. Employers all the time tell us they hire college graduates who don't write well, can't present, and struggle with math and budgets. They can't solve problems. And major employers in manufacturing, healthcare, retail, hospitality, logistics, and technology tell us they'd send more of their promising employees to college if they knew it would give them new competence in managing teams, making decisions, addressing challenges, and innovating solutions. But increasingly, it doesn't. They wish college could be better at producing thinkers cut out for success in the workplace and much more accessible to many more workers. So a team of education innovators set out to reinvent college with these needs front and center. And in 2012, the College for America was born. Established with a million dollar Educause Gates Foundation grant, the College for America was built to deliver an all new kind of degree for the new American worker. Instead of racking up course hours, grades, and credits, students work in an innovative online environment to master competencies in nine areas. Communication skills, critical and creative thinking, digital fluency, quantitative skills, personal effectiveness, ethics and social responsibility, teamwork and collaboration, business essentials, and science, society, and culture. They work at their own pace to master tasks and assignments. Gone are the questionable grades and paper-filled processes. Either you've mastered a skill online and can move on, or you haven't. Employers know where employees are in the process, not by what classes they've completed, but by what skills they've mastered. The New College for America approach was founded and is housed at Southern New Hampshire University, a nonprofit institution widely recognized as the nation's best and most innovative provider of online degrees, and incorporates the most leading edge knowledge about workplace learning. This competency transcript model has become the first in the nation to be approved by the Department of Education and students love it. At $2,500 per year, the degree price is a fraction of the price of virtually all other degree options. And with the Department of Education support, the degree is eligible for all the federal aid that's available to traditional students. And they get a high level of support. Students are pulled forward by a College for America coach, a self-chosen accountability partner, a national online network of learners just like them, and a local network of learners and supporters within their company. And in workplaces across the country, it's working. At Anthem Blue Cross Blue Shield, CEO Lisa Gurton brought College for America to the company's employees for several reasons. We can attract and retain the best employees when we can offer benefits like a college degree, she says. And those strong employees become even more valuable as they learn to solve problems and innovate. At ConAgra Foods, President of Consumer Foods Andre Howe connected with the empowering sense of support and community that is part of College for America. I love that our main role is to offer support and encouragement, he recently told us. It's not just another learning platform. We get to be a part of helping employees earn a better future. That's a great fit with our culture. By re-engineering the traditional college model and rebuilding it for the development of the new American worker, the College for America has found a way to deliver more skills, more accountability, more access, more opportunity, more success, more innovation. We have finally found a way to give our workers the college level skills they need to advance their careers, their companies, and their country. We have finally truly innovated a college for America.